Hello, hello, everybody. I am Pastor David Frederick. I'm coming to you today to introduce to you Apostle Walter Barber, who will be with us at Christlet Tabernacle in Ghana, North Carolina, for our healing and deliverance service this coming Sunday, fifth Sunday of the month at four o'clock. And I want y'all to join us. And here I have with me Apostle Walter Barber to give us a little bit more information about what's going to be occurring. Well, first of all, it is an honor to be here with you Amen. and to be Amen. a part of what God is doing. I love to say this as a son, which you are, Amen. and pastor Amen. of Christ Lit Church. I'm looking forward to being there. I've already spoken to the people in this area, and we've been praying about this, music Amen. getting Amen. ready, looking for great moves of God. I'm expecting yes, God to manifest himself through many deliverance of that Amen. particular time. Amen. I mean, Apostle, I, I, listen, uh, everybody sometimes got to know that there's many facets of deliverance. It's not only just in the Holy Spirit and the Word, but it's good to know how to work it all together. Can you give us a little bit of information about that? Yes. One, one of the great things, and I'll try to make this as simple as I possibly can. So often when we think about healing, we always think about just the physical aspect. Yes, sir. But healing in itself is for the whole body. James says it like this. He said, call for the elders of the church that they may pray the prayer of faith and anoint you. And it talks about being healed. Those of you who need to be healed, it says, if there be any sick yes, among sir. you. Yes, sir. Now, the key to that scripture that people fail to grasp is the first few verses. If there be any sick among you, yes. let them, them. let mm -hmm. them indicate you have faith and confidence that if you come, you'll be healed. Well, healing is not just for your physical body. Yes, sir. God always talks in threes. So if he talks in threes, there has to be a spiritual healing, yes, sir. a soulish healing, as well as a physical healing. Yes, so the whole principle of healing is wholeness. So all of those that come out think, well, maybe I don't have a sickness. I don't have COVID. I don't have this. Well, if you have COVID, of course, we're not looking for you to come. <laughs> but if you do, Amen. God can heal you. But there are other things that can be declared sickness, like depression. Yes, sir. All right. Absolutely. All of those type things come mental illness. Come out the power of God. That name of Jesus that's above every name. Well, that's awesome healing in that. Yes. If you'll just begin to expect, if I can only get there, be yes. like the woman. Yes, sir. Yes. That said, sir. if I can just get to him and touch the hem of his garment, I'll be made whole. Behold. That expectation was what he connected with and declared to be faith. And she was made whole. So there's a wholeness I'm looking forward to. Man, come out, whatever it is, if you're going through a, an addiction, you need deliverance. Yes. You need healing. Listen, everybody, you just heard from the Apostle Walter Barber from Victory Faith Center in Goldsboro, North Carolina, building up to this fifth Sunday, the 31st of July at four o'clock at Christlet Tabernacle for our healing and deliverance service. So therefore you can come and get your word of deliverance, your word of salvation, your word to enlighten and enrich you because we are here to meet you right where you are. I am Dr. David. Meet me there.